to talk to you about teaching your dog how to target. We're going to talk about targeting our hand because once we teach our dog to target our hand, we're also going to follow up with a different behavior with the use of this training. So, what is this good for? This is good for a lot of things. I'm going to demonstrate it in this video. So, basically what we're going to do is, what you're going to do is, you're going to present your hand, whether it's front or back. I'm going to use my back hand. It doesn't matter. Your dog's going to know basically what it is, but I'm going to use my back hand because I'm going to use it in a different training later on in the video, possibly on a different video. But on this video, we're going to teach your dog how to target your hand, right? So basically what you're going to do is you're going to have food. Obviously, maybe it's your dog's meal time or you're just giving him extra treats. We're going to use food kibble. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to present my hand to the dog and the moment the dog goes to investigate it or to look or looks at it or sniffs it, we're going to mark the behavior with a yes and then we're going to reward the dog with food. So this is how it goes. So basically you present your hand, yes. Your dog's probably going to go and investigate your hand because it thinks there's food there, right? But there's not food there. You don't have food in that hand. You're just presenting your hand. Yes. Yes. So your dog is always going to repeat behaviors that they get reinforced for. So if your dog is barking at the mailman and that's reinforcing to them, they're going to continue barking at the mailman. If you tell your dog to sit and you give them a food reward, they're going to continue to sit when you tell them to because they're going to get a food reward. So it's the same concept. Your dog is going to repeat behaviors that they get reinforced for. For this one, your dog is investigating your hand. He gets food for investigating your hand. So you see, you notice that, and this is good that you guys seen that because I stuck my hand in my pocket and the dog forgot about my hand. So you want to keep your hands out of your pocket. Yes. And this is good that this is happening because guess what? No, no one's perfect and I want you to see the mistakes that you might be doing like I'm doing so like that you can correct them. Yes. So remember, don't mark the behavior if your dog almost went for your hand after he knows, after he knows how to do it. Mark it when he touches your hand. Yes. Over here. Don't drop food because then he's going to get distracted. Yes. So now that you do this exercise with your dog and your dog is constantly touching your hand, you, you can also teach your dog to do other behaviors like maybe if I put this down, I'm going to reward her for, for touching this Kong, right? So I'm going to put it on the ground and I'm going to wait for her to sniff it. And then once she sniffs it, I'm going to uh, reward it, mark it and reward it. And then I'm going to show you what I, uh, what I do with my hand uh, training on the next video. Yes. So make sure there's nothing inside that cone. Yes. Yes. You see how she's going after because I rewarded her for sniffing the cone. Yes. 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 Let's try something else. Let's put this away. Let's try uh, let's try this this red thing here, right? This is her toy. She does cheerleading. So I'm just gonna put it on the floor. Yes. So she was trying to figure out what to do. She spun. That wasn't it. Yes. She went to touch it again. You can try this with your dog. Try with different things. Nope, not that. Yes. Yes, the correct thing, right? You can try with your keys. Maybe you can teach your dog to find your keys. Basically, you're going to do the same thing. Put your keys down, let your dog sniff it, and then you can add a cue later. So we're going to see if she does it again for the last time. We want to end on a good success, right? So your dog can continue wanting to do it. She's 
trying to figure out what's going on here. It's not that. Yes, and she did it. So, make sure that you tune in for my next video and I'm gonna show you what I did with the training with touching the hand. Thank you for watching. Yes. Thank you.